Good morning guys, welcome to another week in my life. Sorry, I did not know what that was. You guys know the drill. This week I am working and starting my first, my second. This week I am working and starting my second semester of my sophomore year in college. So it's going to be pretty busy. I'm working two different jobs and I'm taking 15 credits, five classes. So it's gonna be a pretty crazy week. So I just thought I'd bring you guys along. I am on my break right now um, because I don't have certain qualifications. I go on my break from 12.30 to 2.30, I think. I'm gonna eat lunch and I am going to um, do a couple things for school. I have to file an appeal for financial aid because there's like an issue with my credit, so I have to do that. And then I think I also have to email or text my boss my availability for the rest of the week and then i'm also going to listen to michelle reed's podcast slash watch a youtube video that she just uploaded which i'm really excited about i feel like every time i vlog i'm watching michelle reed which is just so ironic but yeah i'm probably gonna watch one of her videos right now i thought that this all would be fun just to kind of reflect on the past year on my best and worst purchases of 2020 so in that other video i talked all right guys so i just filed my appeal here it is right here if you guys want to see it i just filed my appeal here for financial aid and i also just sent out this little email that i'm not going to be on campus for work study this semester um and that was like a burning thing that i really had to do Alright y'all, I'm going to give you a quick update. I just did a 10 minute tidy downstairs, did a little bit of cleaning because sometimes I just get into that mood. So I just did that. I just changed into these sweatpants that belong to my mother and some comfy shoes. <laughs> I'm all over the place. Right now we have a mission to complete before tomorrow. I need a chair for this space, not this chair because this is like my recording stool and it's way too high so i just need a nice comfy keyword comfy chair to put here to get ready for school tomorrow and i also need to buy some more coffee this is like my last cup of coffee in here so i need to buy coffee creamer the starbucks one that's caramel macchiato so good i'm gonna get that i have to buy actual coffee like grounds and I gotta pick up food for my, for my sister. So I think that's all I have to do. And I wanna make it back here early so I can prep myself for tomorrow because I'm feeling a little bit anxious, if you cannot tell. So. There's gotta be more. Hmm? There's gotta be a room for That's what you think. Stop it. That's appropriating someone's culture. Right, guys, we're gonna see if we can find anything in here. I'm vlogging this week, by the way. It's the start of classes. It's from your height point, person. Yeah, so it's like it's like this. Brought me a little dinner chicken nugs and a side salad. I now regret getting salad. I wish I had fries, but everything's fine. You're going to memorize the periodic table. Number one, you're not going to be a chemist. Number two, if you are, hang up the periodic table in the room you're working. <laughs> I don't get that stuff. What year was the French and Indian War? Just Google it. You don't have to memorize it. That's true. You need to understand uh, cost risk analysis, stuff that actually matters in life. Purpose in your heart right now 
to practice something called delayed gratification. Morning coffee run. Guys, you can't tell at all, but it is literally snowing right now. What the heck? Hello, friends. I am ooh, nervous. Ooh, that was my gaslight. Okay, so I am on my break right now, but this is really just my break to do class. So I don't know if he's going to go for the whole time from 3.30 to 4.45, but that's when this class is allotted the time for. So... I don't know if we're just going to be doing intros or a whole lesson, but I am feeling so nervous. Like, I don't even know why, but, uh. but this, this professor, as you saw, seems pretty darn funny. So I am just hoping for the best and yeah, we're just going to do what to do. Also, I might put my hair down because I feel like pretty ugly right now. <laughs> I'm so tired, dude. That class is so draining. Now I think I'm gonna go back into work, but I'm also kind of thinking like, I'm hungry, like I wanna get food. I think I'm gonna run back into work, we'll see what happens. Welcome to the first day of real classes in a real setting. I am about to log on. I have about five minutes and I've made some breakfast, more like a snack, but this is just organic peanut butter on a blueberry bagel and I sprinkled some cinnamon on there. I have my water, I have my coffee, my class is going to be on there. I actually just pulled this chair from outside, like it's one of our like outdoor lounge chairs and it kind of fits perfectly so i might just keep it here i'm not sure yet but i think i might i woke up at 6 a.m this morning yeah, I woke up at 6 this morning, which sounds early, but when you have an 8 a.m. class, like, you, that only gives you, like, an hour and a half to really do your morning and get ready, so I feel like I didn't have that much time, but it's okay. That's good. Through Canvas, Blackboard, Collaborate. Thursday, 121, it's today. Join session. I've never used Blackboard Collaborate before. Can anybody see and hear me? I can see and hear you. Yeah, I sort of can. You all can see my setup is still going over there, but I am officially done with classes for today. I am feeling 
so motivated like I'm sure everybody feels like that in the beginning of the semester but I feel so motivated I'm excited to learn I'm excited to take notes and use my pens and my highlighters and I'm excited to study and I just feel like a big fat nerd the class that I was just in I didn't really film at all because you guys have seen me in class more than enough today but I had psychology of addiction from 8 a.m. to 9 15 then I had to take my sister to work so I had to start my second class which is an african-american studies which was from 9 30 to 10 45 I had to do the beginning half of that class driving back from dropping my sister off at work because we share a car so I did that and it was so funny I had to introduce myself while I was driving but she didn't just like call on you she made us do popcorn so I couldn't see the screen so I was like can you just pick someone for me because I can't see I'm driving it was so awkward but it's fine I love my professor for that class I've had her before so she's great life is good I'm very happy I actually had time to like get ready but the well, one thing about Zoom that I'm very happy about is the mute button because my stomach was grumbling. And you know how embarrassing it is for that to happen like in actual class? Like imagine being able to meet yourself in person. But yeah, so my stomach is grumbling. I think I'm gonna get ready for work right now. Today, all we have left is um, I have to go to work in my dad's office from about 12.30 to two. And then I'm coming to my other job at the daycare from about three to five. If you haven't subscribed yet, you might as well because I make a lot of college videos. Quick plug. <laughs> Sorry, okay. Also, what I wanna tell you guys, I like keep forgetting my train of thought, but I just learned today that my, f I have a physio, phys I cannot pronounce it, physiological psych class that is asynchronous. My marriage and family psychology class is asynchronous. My writing class only meets on Mondays and my African-American diversity class only meets on Thursdays. So I basically, my schedule is kind of wacky, but like now I have one class on Monday, which is writing. I have one class on Tuesday, which is psych of addiction. Then I have no classes on Wednesday no class on Wednesday. Thursday, I have Psych of Addiction and African American Studies. And then I have no classes on Friday. So life on the calendar seems real chill, but I am going to have to be doing like a lot of personal, individual at home work by myself. So I'm really going to be super prayerful about the semester and really put my all into it, but not just my all. I'm really going to be drawing on strength from God, which is why you guys saw this morning, like I really like to start with devotion, reading the word and prayer and even a stretch if I have time because I really don't believe that I'm going to get through this semester just on my own. Like I'm really learning to trust God and actually lean on him, which is funny because my devotion for this morning was talking about waiting on the Lord and and having your strength renewed. And that's like my theme word for 2021 is strength. And I am just so at peace and so calm about leaning on God. I was actually really worried about today, like very anxious and stressed out last night, um, just cause I felt like there's so much stuff going on. But honestly, now I just feel a lot more Zen and peaceful and calm. So I'm really thankful to God for that because it's only by his strength. Otherwise, I'd probably be very overwhelmed. Honestly, it's funny. I'm not going to preach or anything, but I'm just saying like, you know how usually people do introductions and they say like their name and their major. She had to say our name and like a three word check in. So like a couple words, of how we're feeling in life and school with the state of the world. And a lot of people were like, I'm feeling really anxious. Someone really said I'm feeling disheartened. I'm feeling unmotivated i hate zoom like people were just saying all this stuff and in a lot of ways i felt so bad but i am so glad that i have a hope in jesus so i don't have to say that i'm feeling anxious and even if i am feeling anxious i can be like okay well i might feel like that but i can cast my cares on the lord and not carry that burden with me so if you're feeling like that today if you're feeling um disheartened or 
just sad or just a little bit down, know that you can call on Jesus for help. The Bible says in Matthew 11, I think it is, come to me all you who are weary and heavy laden or who carry heavy burdens and I will give you rest. So you're not going to find rest in the world. You're not going to find rest in drugs. It's so funny. We talked about addiction today in class too. You're not going to find rest in a Xanax that calms you down for a couple of hours. You're not going to find rest in that because all the things that the world labels as rest, they all come with caveats. They all come with um, like a, a catch, you know, but Jesus, there is no catch to him. He is just perfect. He is good and he will give you everything you need because he loves you. So if you're feeling a little bit down today, then call on Jesus for help. Call on him for strength and he will give it to you because he is so faithful. That's my little spiel for this afternoon. Um, I'm probably not going to vlog a lot in the middle of the day because it's just going to be busy and I don't want to add more to my stress or have like these really awkward clips that don't even fit into the vlog. So I'm probably going to see you guys a little bit later today, but I love you all and I will see you very soon. Hey guys, so I've been home from both jobs for a little bit now. I had dinner and I've kind of just been laying here recuperating because I feel so exhausted. Like it is literally 8.30 and I'm ready to just be conked out for the night. <sighs> Tomorrow is Friday. Another day, another set of scrubs. This is from Scrubology. So comfortable, it makes me feel like I'm wearing normal clothes. And then just this sweater from Target that I've been wearing for like a whole month in a row. Yeah, so this is our little fit for today. Also guys, I just wanted to share that I'm kind of gonna go with a baby face today because I don't have the time or energy to put on makeup right now, so this is what we're looking like. Let's go. Dr. Will's office to confirm your appointment today at 10.45 a.m. All right, we'll see you then. Have a great one. Bye-bye. off of work from the office and I work from about 9 a.m. to 2.30, 2.45 and I have work here at the daycare at 3.30 just taking temperatures so I literally had to rush out of there like it started getting so busy after like 1 o'clock and it was just really a lot so I just grabbed a little snacky snack this is these are I got some wake up wraps and then I also got um, a donut just because I was craving a little something sweet. So I got that. I'm just drinking my water and it is 310 right now and I really have to pee. I just cannot hold that in. I like I have to pee so bad. But I haven't had time to pee all day. Probably gonna eat for like 15 minutes while listening to the For the Girl podcast. Hashtag new podcast alert. I'm actually kind of loving them. I will link the podcast in the description if I remember to, but they're really good. Two Christian girls just talking about real life stuff and I really enjoy them. <laughs> it's about to go down. <laughs> 